my summer break unit is over. And that's my next big project. As you can see, this is a nice storage room for a lot of my cards. I actually have my cards in three different areas. kind of a pain. Not organized. This is driving me nuts. So this is a little storage room we have. An old bedroom that I am going to turn into my sports card room. So I'm going to drag everything out. Get things organized. I want easy, you know, I know exactly where my boxes, my player boxes are. Um, so this is going to be a big project. But uh, step one, let's empty this room out. And then uh, we'll try to figure out how I'm going to lay set tables up and stuff like that probably record in here too so uh, definitely have to replace that light so uh, let's clip this place cleared up all right i made it to the back wall I'll clean the room out now my plan is i'm just going to use my existing furniture right now these are actually tables i use for card shows and whatnot and uh, i'm actually going to uh, kind of just use my existing furniture for a while to see what i need and then probably get some really nice wood desk you know, wrap around desk. Don't know how many, how much I need, but I think I need a lot. So, but I figured I'd do these two um, six foot tables, and I get this little four foot table. So this will be mainly where I put my um, my cards and uh, sorting and all that. So we'll see how these tables work out. See if I need more. If I need more, I'll add more table space down the road. And uh, but I saw these, so they're kind of not great looking. I got three different colors. Did the trifecta of colors here so um, I saw these on Amazon never really seen these before when I was doing card shows actually I use most of these shows I set up behind my table so you have double the space you got a little bit of room really worked out well for card shows to uh, maximize the space that you had um, so to table to work on or table to put more stuff on so so I got three of these different colors but I saw these table covers on Amazon they're actually pretty cheap like ten fifteen dollars if you and uh, they supposedly go all the way to the legs. So I'm thinking about putting more overflow cards underneath. So I'm going to put these on, see how they look. Because um, once I have them on, they shouldn't um, have too much wear. But it's because I'm just going to set boxes on that uh, not going to move a lot. So let's put these on. We'll see what it looks like afterwards. All right, I have them on. I have to say they look pretty nice. Um, I think this one's a little lighter black, but that's okay. That's a, a smaller, so it's a different... Different size, different color, a little bit, but actually they do some. They went on pretty easy. I think they look pretty good for now. So, like I said, this is one of my temporary tables until I figure out my layout. But I definitely can hide some overflow stuff underneath them, so it doesn't look so bad. So now I get to load up, and uh, I'm going to use this big table over here, the six foot, and that six foot are going to be my uh, player collections, player collection boxes. So I'm going to put probably baseball in this one and basketball and football on this one and this is going to be where I shoot my videos probably on this table right here so let's get to work and we're going to start uh, filling these tables up with boxes all right I got all my player boxes together um, I'm a little short on this table for my baseball I got retired and one uh, active player plus I have to add a lot more new players on this I have not done much this year to add the new players but uh, yeah, pretty happy. I'd be able to uh, insert cards, take cards out pretty easy now with my baseball, so happy with that. Um, not finished with my video table, but that's that. And as you can see, football is pretty crowded. Got some double, triple boxes over here, and basketball got stocked up. So not idea where I can just go in and out real easy yet, but uh, there's some stuff to take care of. Now I have little overflow boxes here, which I'm going to be putting underneath the table, so kind of out of sight, out of mind. But the big issue I have is all these shoe boxes. I don't know, about 80 of them. Um, so those are my, I used to take three bins to my card show. So I had about 10 shoe boxes each. I'd take 30 of those and my two display cases. I'd take tables and then I'd take like a that size box for memorabilia and overflow stuff too. So I kind of stopped doing shows for right now. So um, but my big goal is to clear out this closet, put all this in the closet then I can use my basketball I can move on to um, there so I have my basketball here my football spread out probably pretty good but then the only thing is my baseball I think I'll show you my other side yet what I'm doing with my other side of the room but uh, so next would be to clear out the closet I'll actually put all this thing underneath clear out the closet if I can get oh yeah all these bins have my extra wax in here I have some other wax another spot too so that's all my wax and that's all this bins and boxes are wax 
So I'll probably put the wax and all those boxes into the closet. And have a little bit more room to work. I definitely need to get rid of this light. I've been hitting this thing about 30 times already with my head. It's just at the perfect height where you don't think that you're going to hit your head. But you do hit your head. So definitely going to hit the Home Depot for that. Get some new curtains for my wall here. Figure out my lighting and everything for my videos. Probably not going to shoot a video for a little bit. But uh, yeah, so it's coming along. That's it for uh, today's uh, vlog. I do need to look for this judge, Mr. 62 home runs. See if I have anything cool in here. But uh, that's it for this time. Um, I'm going to do some work and I'll do another vlog of me uh, trying to finish up uh, my new trading card room. It should be exciting. So that's it, guys. Thanks for watching and we'll catch you next time.